Today on Toy Shiz, hello nurse, let's talk toys. Welcome back everyone, Toy Shiz here, and I am back yet again to give you guys another fresh look, courtesy of my friends over at NECA Toys, and today, we're totally checking out, in many ways than one, the new Gremlins 2, the new batch, the Greta Gremlin, ultimate Greta Gremlin to be exact, nice packaging, all over the place, of course, this comes from the sequel to Gremlins, which was completely wackadoo, but I actually did like it more than the first one, if I'm being 100% honest. And then, uh, yeah, you have the barcode. These are starting to hit Target stores now, so if you're on the lookout, hopefully you can pick yourself up one of these. I mean, who wouldn't want to pick this up, right? Wink, wink, nudge, nudge. You get really nice photo of the Greta Gremlin on one side of the flap and inside the other you get to see everything that comes with her so this is gonna be interesting sit back relax grab yourself a nice hot cup of coffee this is a look at the brand new NECA toys Gremlins 2 the new batch Greta Gremlin and here's old Greta out of the packaging and she does come with a few accessories she has an interesting look to her and again one that NECA is so good at capturing it looks directly from the movie I mean they've done a fantastic job with the accessories with the paint with the hair it's a lot of fun and if you're a big fan of Gremlins Gremlins 2 yeah she's definitely going to be worth it for your shelf now with the extra hands you can see the detail the colors the big red fingernails, I mean, it's all there. And these are more for the accessory holding hands, like this female sex hormone beaker, straight from the movie, yeah? Filled with the pink goo, and yeah, you can see inside, it's very well done, so that's interesting. And then with the actual figure itself, you might want to get yourself a NECA stand. She stands well, but sometimes she takes a topple, especially with her arms. But look at the paint on this really gorgeous Pinks, greens, just everything really pops. It's a very feminine looking gremlin, as it should be, but it's also very disturbing at the same time. She does have this really nice green doll hair, as I would describe it. It's nicely done. The pink boa is a separate piece. The skirt, the legs, the heels. She's got peg holes on the bottom of her feet. Big forearms, big arms, in fact. Really nice reach on her. And yeah, that is from the movie. It doesn't didn't really strike me for, I was like, wow, she's got really long arms, but she's got nice articulation all over the place, enough for what you'd expect for a gremlin figure. So again, she will stand nice, she's got nice articulation in the leg, the the skirt is a rubber piece, so it really won't get in the way, but she's got single jointed knees, and then she has high heels, very, very high heels with some ankle rocking position, spins at the Elbows, you can swap the hands, actually pretty easy. They go in and out, just like that. So these hands, more for the beaker. These ones for any number of accessories, as you can see. The beaker really won't fit in these more open hands, but this one's right here, where the fingernails and hands are a little bit more clenched. Yeah, she has no problem holding the beaker right there. I just like the, the red lipstick on that. <laughs> the face is ridiculous. And yeah, when you match her up with other gremlins, she will be taller, obviously, because she's wearing high heels. But they do look very different, and that's a good thing. I mean, she really stands out, especially just with all the different gremlins. They're very much, for me now, a holiday display piece. I really like, I had them out for Christmas, I'll be doing that again. Very cool display, especially when people come over. It's quite the conversation piece, but uh, I like that it's very different, very unique, Oh, and so in all honesty, yeah, it's if you're a big Gremlins fan, I think you're going to have a blast with this figure. If you've never seen Gremlins, don't care. Yeah, it's not going to be up your alley. But in terms of the paint, which is stellar, I do like that they included that realistic type hair. The pink boa is a nice touch. It's very disturbing, but also very fun. Uh, you know, it's, it comes with the beaker, extra hands. You really don't need much more than that. But it's definitely cool. But I'm curious to know what you guys think about this Greta Gremlin. Will you be picking one up? Comment below. Let me know. Let's talk everything Gremlins. And thank you again to NECA Toys for sending this over to give you guys this fresh look. As always, drink some great coffee, eat some great food. But most importantly, remember, just, just be careful when you're, when you're drinking random stuff out of beakers. You just you never know what's going to be in there. When you do, let me know what you found. I'll talk to you guys soon. Adios. Adios.